guys, so I've gotten the scroller box subscription art supplies pack. Uh, hashtag not sponsored. This is something that I pay for myself and I'm really satisfied with it so far. So I'm gonna open it with you guys so that you can see what it's all about. I'm just gonna get some scissors. Just wait, wait here. Couldn't find any scissors, but this will have to do. Let's see here. And here we go. Let's see. Oh, come on. Don't be so stubborn. There we are. Ooh, what's this? Oh, wow. A line painter, water based pigment painter. And it's with what, five colours? What, that's a really cool case. Wow. That's really, really cool. I love the pattern of it. It's really nice. Oh, I thought for a moment that it said peppermint, so I was like, oh, it's scented. But no, it's just permanent. That's nice too. So let's see what's in here. Let's look at the art piece first because every month you get uh, a print from an artist and what you get is what the artist used to make the print or the, the of course, the original of the print, but you know. Hey, Boomy, what are you eating? Sorry. All right, so let's see. This is this month's art print. And the artist is, oh, sorry, it was supposed to be like this. And the artist is Jodie Beckley. And you can find her uh, on Instagram under Copper Designs. I'm gonna check her out. This is really cool. It's like a mandala. Blah, 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 blah. It's like a mandala. Mandela? No. Mandala. How about saying that right? Okay, so let's check this out. Let's see what this is. Ooh, so this is like the, the explanations for what you get. So I'm gonna look at that later on. Ooh, I see a candy. Oh, it's grape flavored. Yes, I like that. And let's see. Ooh, what's this? Art line, ergo line, fine. Point four. So it's like a fine liner. Huh, the design was really cool on this one. It was like a fancy, more fancy fine liner. I'm gonna check it out later on. Let's put that right here. And this is writer memory system. Let's see. So it's like a calligraphy pen, maybe. Hmm, so that's a fine tip. And then it's, ooh, there. And then it's probably, ooh, so it's like a, more like a permanent marker then. I was expecting like a calligraphy tip. Oh, here it is, it says so. So this is 0 0.5 and this is 1.2. That's cool. And, ooh, yes, I like these. It's like the whole pencil is just like lead. I like that. I think that's a really cool sign choice. It's probably just like a thin film right outside of it so that it keeps it, well, you know, not like you get dirty on your fingers. Probably do you want to do it up here though. Sorry about my, my hands by the way. But yeah, and then you get your sticker, and I see I got a sketchbook in my favorite color. It's blue, oh, oh wow, that's adorable. Oh, I love that. It's a really handy, like small sketchbook. You can use it for ideas and stuff. I love writing down ideas when I get them, because usually I forget them. I'm really forgetful. So um, if I'm at work and I get uh, like a really nice idea 
I think that, oh, I'm gonna remember it when I'm finished at work, but then it's like, no, it's like with a dream. When you wake up, it's like, oh, I'm gonna remember this for the rest of my life, but then you don't. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Hmm, seems like I'm missing one. Or maybe I'm not, oh, of course, no. Okay, so this is a fine line paint pen that gives an immense depth of color, even on dark backgrounds. Ooh, so it's like a jelly pen, maybe. Even on dark backgrounds? That sounds amazing. You know what, we're gonna have to check that out. Just one second. Okay, I'm back with some black paper, so we're gonna check that out. I can see that my head is <laughs> like in frame, so you can see me even though I'm not there. I'm sorry about that, I'm gonna get better at the lighting for these types of videos, but I just wanted to try it. <laughs> okay, so let this, let's get this plastic off it. It's too bad that every pen is wrapped in plastic, that's not nice for the environment. Hey, come on. Blah, 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 blah. So how long is it gonna take for me to get this plastic off? Ooh. Okay, so what does it say? Okay, shake it. Shake, shake, shake. Store horizontally. Shake, 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 shake. And then you're gonna put it down. I always wonder if it's like press down once and keep it there or if it's like push it down repeatedly. Ooh, look at that! Oh wow! That's vibrant! <gasps> I want to check out the others as well. Got to shake, shake it. Let's shake it. Shake it, 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 shake Oh, yes! Oh, wow! That's amazing! Okay, I'm gonna be weird. I have to, have to smell it. Okay, it's not peppermint, peppermint, but... That's really vibrant. That's so cool. to like if you get a wet pencil and you can well not pencil is it called pencil no like watercolor brush Jesus Christ. and I could like maybe you can get it to bleed so you can use it sort of like watercolor since it's water based paint isn't that isn't that the term for watercolor like it's, it's watercolor water based paint I would have thought that was sort of in the same ballpark at least. Okay. For orange, let's see what happens. Oh, this one is slower. Ah, oh, there we are. That's a nice orange. Let's see how it is in, on, on the white paper as well. Ah, oh, look at that. It's 
nice. Very nice. Got to do that with the rest of them. Oh, it's a really nice color. I really like these. I think I'm gonna use them a lot. Although I've gotten really, really like cozy with my watercolors, I don't really dare to try new things anymore. I really want to try gouache and I really want to try acrylics. And I used to do a lot of markers, like pro markers and Winsor and Newton and stuff like that. But I've gotten so comfy. Oh, shake, shake, shake. Uh, so now I don't really dare to try new things because I know, <laughs> I mean, I can handle the watercolors. I'm not like, I still feel like I'm a noob. <laughs> I don't really know how to do it yet, but at least I'm a bit more comfortable than I, what I am with new mediums. Ooh, so vibrant. Wow. That's really cool. Tiny heart, aww. I can't really see it on the white paper, can you? That's nice. And each month you get a, like, a challenge as well. So this, this month's challenge is equilibrium. I'm not completely sure what that means, actually. Equilibrium. I'm gonna have to Google it. Equilibrium means a state in which opposing forces or influences are balanced. So, yeah, it's actually like this one then. Different forces are balanced. Hmm, I like that. Maybe I'm gonna try to make something out of that challenge. I'm not that good drawing under pressure. <laughs> I was thinking about maybe trying to like sketch something out with all that I got but maybe that will be a separate video for now. I hope that you will forgive me because I'm a bit nervous still drawing in front of people uh, but I hope you like this. Oi! Ruined my sketchbook already. No, I didn't. But yeah, I hope you like this and I'll try to film the next package that I get from Scholarbox as well. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. 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 <laughs>